It's 7.26. I woke up at like 6.50 and I'm so excited for my coffee today. And I don't know why I stored it like this. I think it's because I wanted to save the bag so I could share. But I mean, by now you guys know that I have the Breville Barista Touch. And I've been using the same La Cologne beans for over a year. I used to use Blue Bottle. Then I think I used like some random coffee shop brands. And then I used La Cologne. And I used to switch around beans a lot. And then over the last year, I kind of just stuck with the same bean so i've tried alfred espresso beans before so i thought i would try it the only con is that you have to pay for shipping with these beans and they're a little bit since you do have to pay for shipping it's more expensive than what i was paying before but i drink my coffee at home every single day i feel like it's fine to spend like 20 25 dollars on espresso beans so i think that was the main thing holding me back because i was having such a good deal at la Colombe. i think it was charging me like 13 dollars every two weeks for a whole bag of beans free shipping so that's kind of why i was just like what whatever um it's so it's so affordable so cheap but i just was getting sick of the flavor so i decided to switch i at first was looking back at blue bottle and blue bottle is like around the same price as a bag of alfred beans like i said i've had these before i've had alfred coffee before so i kind of know what it tastes like but it was years ago so i'm kind of excited to have this and give it a try i already have some in here more so i just want to share i'm finally trying new wings yeah i wanted to start off the vlog too while i made my coffee recommend changing up your beans it's almost like visiting a new coffee shop in your kitchen <laughs> We're about to get in the car and head to West Palm Beach. We're going to West Palm Beach to take our engagement photos. We're taking them tonight and we're staying the night there and then coming back tomorrow. But I'm wearing something really comfy for the car ride. So I just wanted to quickly share my outfit even though you can't get the sweatshirt anymore because it's sold out from Daily Drills. But wearing this, I don't even know how to describe this color. It's like a grayish bluish green. It's actually on my color chart you know those color analysis that you can do yeah it's on that so wearing this i tucked it up into my bra and then i'm wearing these shorts from aritzia i got them in a size small which i'm glad that i did because they're a little bit loose in the waist and there is no drawstring but i wouldn't have wanted them any tighter throughout the legs or butt area like I wanted them this loose and I felt like if I went any smaller, they would have just been way too tight throughout here. So maybe if you're thinking about getting them size up, they come in a ton of colors. I have a fuzz on them and they're super cute for spring and summer. They are fleece lined, so a little bit warmer. They're not like the, this is terry cloth line, so it's a little bit better for warmer weather. These are fleece, but still shorts. And then these sandals are from Tiki's. They're my favorite spring and summer sandal. I got them last year. I wear them to death. I love them. And I only wanted to pack one pair of sandals. So these, you really can't go wrong. They go with everything. That's the fit. I'm gonna do my makeup when we get down there. I quickly did my hair. I'm definitely gonna touch it up. And I'm crossing my fingers that we can check into the hotel early. They have a 4 p.m. check-in and our photos are at five. I'm really hoping that we can call on the way down there and get checked in at like 2, 2.30 at the latest. So that way I can do my makeup, touch up my hair, and then change. I also got my nails done. This is not like the better looking hand. This is probably the better looking hand. I got um, Let's Be Friends by OPI. And these are not my natural nails. These are tips, but 
I feel like a new person with my nails done. I never get them done. That's the color that I got and I also got it on my toes. But I'm gonna pack up the rest of my stuff and then we're gonna probably get Starbucks. I need to put gas in my car and then we're gonna head to West Palm Beach. It's like a two hour and 20 minute, two and a half hour drive. I'm gonna have to completely touch up my hair. We have to leave probably in a little over an hour. We're gonna get a bottle of champagne for our photos and then for our photographer as like a little extra gift for her for doing this for us. She's our photographer for our wedding as well. So I'm excited for that because now it'll kind of give us it's like one thing to see a photographer's photos with other people in them and then it's another thing to like see photos of you. So I'm excited for the photos. We get to the hotel, we got early check-in which is something that I was originally really worried about. I start doing my eyebrows, getting my hot tools heated up start doing my makeup, looking through my makeup bag, I put on my primer and I look and I forgot my foundation. So literally within 20 minutes, there's a mall like four minutes away. I was originally going into the Sephora, but I walked into a Nordstrom and I was like, oh my gosh, what if they have the foundation that I wear? I've been wearing the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. I've actually been wearing this since 2018. It's the best foundation ever. So I went into Nordstrom and they had an Armani stand and I picked up another foundation, which my cortisol is through the roof. I thought that I packed everything and just like going through your makeup bag and like the sheer panic of not even having foundation when you are taking professional photos, my heart sank. <laughs> but I found this in the lobby because I wanted something other than water when I was coming back up and it's the Recess Mood. It's strawberry rose and it's a calm, cool, collected adaptogen infused sparkling water with magnesium. So let's try it. It's good, really good. That's needed, but can you imagine? I just can't, couldn't believe that that was what was happening. But thank goodness there was a mall right there. Thank goodness there was a Nordstrom. Thank goodness Nordstrom had an Armani Beauty and I was there and back in 20 minutes. And that's just, that's a plus. So we're gonna get ready. Now I really wanna take my time as I'm getting ready, makeup always just comes out better when you take your time. I'm using the Westman Atelier contour stick in Truffle. And then I think we're gonna meet our friends Sean and Sam for dinner. There, she had her, I don't know if I mentioned this. I think so, because I vlogged when we went to their gender reveal back in October, but my friend Sam, she had her baby and I'm so excited. If it all works out, we'll go and meet them for dinner and we'll meet their baby, Artie, for the first time. I'm so excited. All we've seen is photos of them. So we're just so excited. Yeah, we're shooting the engagement photos on Worth Avenue in West Palm Beach. We did beachy engagement engagement photos. Um, I've explained the story a couple times, but the reason that we have like engagement photos after the fact of us getting engaged is because we were supposed to have them the day of us getting engaged, but the photographer's camera broke, so it happened the day after. That's why, and then we were gifted these photos as an engagement gift from our photographer. She's a family friend of Christian's, and then obviously a friend of mine now. We ended up booking her for our wedding, and yeah, she gifted us these as an engagement gift, which was so nice of her. I also love when the bathroom mirrors at hotels are like ring lights. It really helps getting ready. And then I just, on a whim, got this Patrick Ta blush. What color did I get in? She's that girl. I think what sold me on this was the TikTok filter of the, the blushes that you could go through every single Patrick Ta blush and see which one looks good on your face. So I think that was the one I was like, mm. it sold out during this for sale, but it was all of a sudden in stock at a Sephora near me that day. So I ordered it and I haven't used it yet. It's super fresh. So I heard that you're supposed to use this powder then 
cream, but I'm scared to try that with photos. Like I can't risk anything with these photos. I always heard to like put on extra blush, like put on an extra layer because it's the first thing that your skin will kind of like absorb. It absorbs the red and pinky tones, but I could be wrong. I follow this makeup artist and that's what she said. She said to always just add more blush, more blush than you think. This one's really pretty. I really like this. I kind of like bring it into my eye a little. Okay, finished my makeup. I could not talk and do it at the same time. Like there's just absolutely no way. I was really trying to focus on it and I feel like it actually turned out pretty good and I have no idea what I'm doing when it comes to makeup. So I'm actually pretty happy with it, <laughs> to be honest. Thank goodness. There's like no stress like doing your makeup or something that's like gonna be photographed when you really have no idea what you're doing. Like I have no idea what I'm doing. I need to brush through this. It will not look like that. Okay, I just put on my dress. I'll show you what it looks like in the mirror, but one little thing I'm gonna do is put on this Merit, what is it called? A highlighting balm, like a highlighter in Bounce. And I'm just gonna go like this bring some shine to everywhere kind of make it glowy okay i just put on my heels so i'm a little bit taller i raised the camera up so you probably can't tell but i'm gonna pick out some jewelry i don't know if i want to do like big hoops i think i'm gonna leave the two small hoops that i wear there, but I don't know if I should do something like this. Something like a dangly, gemmy style. I also have another style of the dangle. Let me see. Quickly sharing the outfit that I'm wearing for the engagement photos. I feel like it's pretty fun, bridally kind of. It's kind of weird just seeing yourself in a bridally looking outfit. But I got this from Alamore the label. I'll put the name of it on the screen. I'll also link it down below if you're interested. Really, really cute off the shoulder. And then I shared these shoes before, but they're just these clear heels from Zara. They're like under $50. The earrings, I chose these bezel drop earrings from Lily Clasp. We're gonna head out and go get our engagement photos done. I'm so excited. Okay, we're here before our photographer, and I think it's prom or something because everyone's here taking photos too. We're gonna take photos, I think, starting over here, in front of this really pretty wall with the flowers and the blue door. I'm excited. But yeah, there's so many people, like girls in long gowns, and I think it's prom season. Okay, we're packing up to leave as you can see on the bed but i wanted to share my outfit we're going to grab some breakfast i think we're going to pura vida and we're gonna leave west palm beach today it's sunday wanted to quickly share what i'm wearing i'm wearing this long sleeve from donnie it's like a waffle material this bralette is from cotton on and i'm wearing these poplin shorts from daily drills and then my purse is from rebecca minkoff i feel like they made something similar this year. I think it's a lighter raffia style bag, but I'm obsessed with this bag for summer. It's my favorite one. And then I just have this MEJ clip attached to it. And then I only brought one pair of shoes. So these are from Tiki's. And my hoops are from The Perfect Hoop. And this is the outfit of the day. We 
just left breakfast. We're at a stoplight and I feel like my car mount makes my camera shake for driving. We got Pura Vida for breakfast. It's pretty good. I've never had it before. Just seen it. We're gonna go meet up with some family friends that live 45 minutes or 40 minutes north of where we are. So we got Pura Vida before. We got just a iced latte. Sorry if this is shaking. Ice latte with almond milk and vanilla. Christian got this banana cold was a banana coffee of some sort it was so good and then i also got this green juice green deluxe celery cucumber apple spinach kale and lemon really good as well and then i got this wrap with like eggs turkey bacon potatoes arugula it was really good as well just very pricey but that's the plan for today we're gonna go hang out with some family and friends and then we're gonna drive back home later today slash tonight so we got work tomorrow <laughs> 